The following is a presentation of the Retro Network. Hey folks, welcome back to the Wax Pack Flashback Show brought to you by the RetroNetwork.com. I'm your host, Nikki, and today, uh, like I said last week, we're going to get supercharged here. We're going to got some high octane excitement because we're opening a pack of classic monster truck cards. These are from 1990, and that would have been the point in time when I was coming home from school every afternoon and watching monster trucks on ESPN. Uh, they also had the tractor pulls mixed in and the uh, swamp buggy racing, which was really cool. I'm really excited to open these because this was a sweet spot for me with monster trucks, uh, with uh, Carolina Crusher, you had Bigfoot, you had Grave Digger, of course, you had uh, Equalizer, uh, Mad Dog. I'm hoping we find some of those cool cars in here or cool trucks in here today. Uh, I don't know. It's 12 cards. It says collect them all, Bigfoot, Taurus, I remember Taurus, Grave Digger, and many more. I'm super excited for these. Let's rip them open and see what we find. Vroom, vroom. Time to open this pack of classic monster truck cards. Like I said earlier, I was a big fan of coming home after school and watching this on ESPN. These are from 1990, and Classic used to make classic draft pick cards, basketball, football. I used to love those things. I'd track them down everywhere. Get this to where I can preserve this pack. I'm sure we're going to see a lot of wild vehicles in this. Maybe some we've never seen or heard of before. Tall Cool One. Well, that's a cool name for a monster truck right there. Uh, oh, well, that gives you the vehicle detail. 65F Ford F-150 step side. It's hmm. a good looking truck. It's a good name for it, too. The Liquidator. He'll liquidate you. Bigfoot Four. Now, this is not the most famous Bigfoot Four. The most famous Bigfoot Four, and this may be the truck, but they put the big tires on it that they used to carry the pipeline when they were doing the Alaskan pipeline carrying across the tundra. The real monster truck tires. But that would have been before this, so maybe I've got my Bigfoot number wrong, but I'm pretty sure that was Bigfoot 4. Oh, man, ain't this cool? Rambo. we got a Rambo truck. Rambo assaults each monster truck mission armed with 468 cubic inch of big block Chevy power and 14.5 pounds of pure muscle. 1989 K1500 Chevy stands proud at 12 feet 1 inch tall. Suspension is based on leaf springs and 20 rancho shocks. I didn't know Rambo had a monster truck. Okay, that's in the running for favorite card. Then we get a driver, Rick Shue from Tall Cool One. Overkill, nice paint scheme, little neon color going on there. Gary Bauer. Who did he drive? Lone Ranger. He drove the Lone Ranger, I don't remember. Dave Mark Quart. Man, I don't want to see the drivers. I want to see the trucks. Dennis Anderson, driver of the Grave Digger. Legendary driver of the Grave Digger. Oh, daddy's girl. I remember that with the tank treads. That was so cool. Now, the pink color, you know, that is what it is. But, man, that's a cool looking monster trucker. That's in the running, too. We get Bigfoot 9. This was the most recent Bigfoot, I'm pretty sure, around this time. Yeah, the newest Bigfoot, 1994 to F-350. They changed the paint scheme and the logo. Really nice. And Nightmare. I remember Nightmare. That was a good trade. I believe he was based out of North Carolina. And yeah, don't say on here. Man, I think we got another tie on the Wax Pack Flashback for favorite card. This is because it's a Rambo truck. It's awesome. And then we got Daddy's Girl. That's an awesome truck, too. Man, this is really cool. I'm going to find me some more of these. All right, folks, thanks for watching this episode of the Wax Pack Flashback brought to you by theretronetwork.com. Down here below somewhere, you'll see the thumbs up button. Like this video if you liked it. Uh, be sure to subscribe to the channel and uh, turn your notifications on so you don't miss when we have new videos. The Wax Pack Flashback series is not the only shows or well, videos we put here on the channel on YouTube, uh, and you want to catch up with all those next week we're going way back to the 70s one of the older packs of cards that i have in my collection uh it started a, a kind of a well it didn't really start a fashion trend but a lot of people wanted to be this guy after this movie came out uh we're going back to the 70s with john travolta and open this pack of saturday night fever cards i've never opened a pack of these i'm uh 
looking forward to seeing what it is. Though. This actually has a stick of gum in it. I'm sure that is um, very ripe right about now. But that's next week. For now, thanks for watching. Tell your friends. Share it on social media. You can connect with me on social media at Yesterdayville on Twitter. You can hit up um, the Retro Network on all your social media channels at TRN Social. But thanks for watching. We'll see you next week. This has been a presentation of the Retro Network. For more great retro pop culture content, including podcasts, videos, and articles, visit www.theretronetwork.com.